We think that the best place for the Canadian capital should be in Fort Albany. A good reason for Fort Albany is that it's very far from the American borders, so that if the Americans ever did invade, we'd be safe in the capital. Fort Albany is also in the nation of Rupert's Land, so that justifies us annexing it for our new nation. PEI is in need of a bigger port for import and export. This would help with more jobs and more trade between Europe and Canada. Along with the new jobs, this would also help us boost the economy. We would be giving back to the rest of the colonies by helping them export their trade. PEI wants to be in charge of making an anthem for Canada. An anthem would help build up Canadians' morale and patriotism. It would better unite the nation as one. If PEI is to join Confederation, we would like the proper parliamentary representation. PEI does not have a high population. We don't want to be overpowered in Parliament. We want control over the things that will affect us. Things such as our economy, regulation, and education systems. We feel the need that gun control be prohibited in this new nation. We think this because we do not believe that the new confederation will send enough troops to our island as it is not of a super large importance. For this reason, we believe that our people will be our best defense. So we would like them to be able to be equally armed to other militaries. Oh God, the Yanks! <laughs> For this reason, it is essential that if we join Confederation, the taxes, regulations, and subsidies are kept to the minimum level possible, while still having the market provide security in transactions and quality of service. Those are our demands for joining Confederation. I hope all the colonies listened and seized the great value of PI. Thank you for watching.